this is me, MC Gamer, and welcome on back to more The Minish Cap. On today's episode, we're going to continue our journey through the Fortress of Winds as we shoot eyeballs with arrows because it's The Legend of Zelda, and that's what we do, of course. And we are on our way getting more arrows. Excellent. And so we're going to try to figure out what's going on inside this crazy dungeon. We, on our last episode, we finally got the map and compass all... We finally got the map and compass. Man, it, it sounds like Link's Awakening up in here. I haven't done a Let's Play of that game as of the time of recording. Hopefully, one day soon. Looks like it's time to split ourselves in half. Do twice the work with the power of one. The power of one, of course, being a, a, uh, a fan. A fan? Fan? No, that's not what I wanted to say at all. Okay, we can't get through there. Uh, did we did we do a dumb? Did we do we do a mistake here? Oh wait, hold on, wait. Ah, I see what we gotta do. What we need to do is split link horizontally now. And there we go. Oh, apparently hitting R will unsplitify. Now I know, and I will do my best to not do that again. Alright, here we go. So down to the right and then push it up. Very good. Let's say do we see hit a hit a dead end? That's unfortunate. And Key! Where do you think you're going? Come back, Key, you crazy! Hmm, did I just fall down or was it just my imagination? No, it actually fell down. And now we're falling down! And Key! It's a small key. Open doors and blocks. We haven't seen any blocks to open up yet. I'm looking forward to that. And quickly refill on hearts so as to not die, which is my favorite part of video games, the not death. And now we're going to head up the the northern center route. And uh, if we go to the top, we should be able to find... Ow, excuse you. Ah, of course I go up the sides that I haven't opened. Just ignore the Stalfo. Just, just ignore them. Let's go up here. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to kill you guys because I dislike you. <laughs> Remember, I'm s never... Never badmouth MC Gamer. We're going up the left route. Hopefully it's the right route. Ah, uh, seems to be okay so far. Very good. If we go to the left, we find Big Pit. And something that we can open these with arrow. Oh god, it's a it's a floor master. Or wall master. Wall master, actually. And we've opened up the way into what appears to be a room with doors that will close and we'll fight monsters. Hey, there we go. I was waiting for it to happen. This guy seems to be a tricky fellow. Okay, the arrows seem to do nothing. Okay, if you, if you hit him on one side and then get him from the other, he seems to be impervious to my magic. There we go. Have him charge at you. And then give him the business. There we go. There's the strategy. And there we go. He is no more. And I would like more hearts. But the game doesn't seem to want to give me any. So I will I will say screw you to the game and not get them. Okay. Simple game of ri ring around the rosy as it were. I don't know the rest of the words. I sound about posies or something. I don't know what a posy is. But here we go. Grab this, get rid of it. Grab this, get rid of it. Art. All right, good. Game loves me. And we have... Hear that? Cling, cling, cling. It's a different cling, cling, cling than on a different wall, which means I sense secrets in here. Secret, 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 secret. Secrets. In fact... It's the Mole Mitts! Dig, dig, dig to your heart's content! It's a brand new item, the Mole Mitts, and when we attach them, we can eat the cake! That's right, we can have our cake and eat it too. I don't know why you'd want to have a cake. I think I'll eat mine. All right, if anybody gets that reference, leave a comment down below. Look at Link's face when he misses. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> All right, whoa, 100 rupees, man. You know what, eating cake is its something that I think I should do more often. All right, and now that we've done that, the game's like, 
congratulations on your mole mitts. Now get out of here. And I'm like, okay, game, just please calm down. Don't yell at me. Uh, uh. Okay, cool. Look what we can do now. Look at this. We can dig this guy out and give him a good old fashioned link pull. And then push this. And we get a kinstone piece said to bring happiness to at least somebody, not me. And then dig through here. What do we got here? Ah! This is the way to the boss. Alas, we need the boss key though before we do such matters. Before we 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 take such matters into our own hands. Let's actually take the red the red warpy back. It'll probably be faster. Hello! Is this the exit way? No, it is not the exit way. All right, so there is stuff to the right if I remember here. The upper right hand corner had a Big rupee, that's right. Nice. We're full on rupees. We need to buy stuff. Jeez, oh man, we're too good at this game. All right, so we need to figure out a way to shrinkify. Is there going to be a shrinky platform in this? In this mess? If there is, that's really dumb, and I'm really upset. But I guess we'll check real quick. Just uh, All shrinky platforms so far have been too wide. So as long as we don't have any too wide like tiles, I don't know if I'm making any sense. Does that make any sense to anybody? No? Okay. Yeah, like, what do we... Okay, this is the secret one over here that we haven't been able to access. What do we got here? There's a thing. It's a chest with a kinstone piece. A good day was had. Yeah, so let's quickly just dig out this middle column. Yeah, we're good. There's nothing here of importance. And... Dig those holes. Dig it. Whiz robes? Well, that won't do at all. Get out of here, Wizrobe. Whiz robes are silly. Hey, 80 mysterious shells. That was worth our time. And look, while we were gone, cake regenerated. It is now the 12th <laughs> cake. I'm going to stop making Doctor Who jokes. They're not that great either. This isn't the way to go. The way we need to go is all the way to the right, I believe. Because remember, we kind of encountered something over there that was... That was no good. Or am I? Am I? Am I stupid? Yeah, I'm. I'm stupid. There. Let's. Uh, let's check this one. Yeah, it was this one where there was too much cake. I believe that we we had to like, we had to say nope to it. Yes, I was correct. So if we go over here, maybe this will have a key for us. Hopefully not rupees. Hey, kinstone piece, and it's a red one. Is it the one we want? No, it's another freaking E. Why are the why are the kinstone always E? That is the question. Oh, hey. Oh, I don't think that's the one we want. Or it might be. I forget. Oh man, that's a good that's a good thing though. We're having kinstones that aren't just the same old, same old. I like when this happens. Alright, we've been here and we've we've been upset with it. We've done this. But we've never figured out how to get over to the left, did we? Don't think we did. Because we need to... Wait a minute. Hold on, hold on. Can you push these guys? No, you can't. I'm still confused. Okay, I seem to have gone myself further lost. It'd be nice to know where the heck we're supposed to be going right now. But alas, I am an idiot and do not know. Um, let's just drop down. There's nothing for us here. Let's check our map. Like, why not? What do we got? So we can't go to the right yet on the second floor because we don't have a second key. And that's the only area we haven't, like, properly explored. That chest is the big key right there. Yeah, that chest is the big key, but we can't get to it. Because we can't shrinky inside that room. I'm confused! Oh boy! I need a key. So the, the moral of the story is, I need a key. But where do you get a key inside such a place as this dungeon? Okay, it's not there. Is there a way to like 
It'd be nice if there was a way to go to the different areas. There must be some sort of secret here that we're not finding. That has to be it. Like, what's up? Like, and this only leads to the boss door. What was inside the blue warp? This goes to where the... Okay, let, let, let's explore here. Maybe we missed something. Okay, that's that. And this is... Okay. Very neat. And we've been down there before. We've, we've done that. And then this leads us back here, but we don't have a key. So maybe they want us to go back up here, or is this how we originally got to... I'm so confused. This dungeon... Ah! Okay, we're gonna go all the way around real quick. <laughs> maybe I'm dumb. Maybe this is the wrong move. But I'd rather cover all the bases rather than covering none of the... Yep, this is a full circle. It's not even a good circle. Come on. It's not like the circle life. That's a good circle. Come on. Da, da, da. Off the, the bridge of happiness. <laughs> Off the bridge of happiness. The Super MC Gamer story. Wow. Depressing! Cool. Okay, so our issue is... We can't shrinkify here because there is no way to shrinkify. Unless there's a shrinky up here somewhere that we haven't seen and we can fall down using it. But the only place that we can shrinkify... Get rid of this guy. The only way you can shrinkify is out the very, very top. Which is not in this room. It's in this room. Now we can't open up this because we need two links somehow. I've never been able to figure that out because you can't walk the two links through. Unless I'm really dumb. I think I might be really dumb. Okay, let's just get rid of this guy. He's a jerk. Unless I can lead him through. Hey guy, you wanna come through? No? Okay. Fine then, be a jerk. Can I lead my link through like this? Dude, that's so stupid. So the fake one can't go through first? Wow, this game is rigged. I'm so upset right now, whatever. We figured it out, everybody. And and the world was, was at joy today. Okay, so we can go in here. We can turn this guy on so we can access the lever. We can go over here then. Unshrinky. Defeat this guy. See what the, pulling the lever does. This will probably spawn a key, which will fall down the hole. And we fall down there. Oh. Oh, got it. Really? I didn't pull the lever. I'm so dumb. Pull the lever, MC. You're dumb. That spawns a key. It goes all the way down there. Now, here's the strategy. Okay. So, step one. Fall all the way down. Very good. Grab the key. Now we're happy because Link is looking at the key. But now we're going to go all the way back up and we're going to do something special. I'll use this opportunity though to thank Luke the Spoo for $5 and Matt Beeball for $5 with the comment, here is money. Both of those donations, of course, going to, to write Love on Her Arms, a wonderful charity that aims to forgive hope to those who are struggling with depression and self-harm and, and, and suicide thoughts. Those are no good things. So uh, they're, they're a wonderful charity and I've actually really been happy lately to uh, really find out more about them and uh, give them help. So uh, your donations are appreciated going towards that charity. There's a link in the description if you wish to donate. I recommend that. So now that we're minified, here's the deal. Watch this. Fall down while mini. And now we can go through here and get to the piece of heart. Aha, uh -huh. and we have the key, which means we're good to enter the area that we haven't got to yet. It's all, everything's coming together. This stupid dungeon's finally, finally gonna be done, like, making sense. It's gonna be done making sense? It's going to make sense. Well, 
One of these blocks has to work, it has to. And we're good to go then, we're good to go to advance. But we're going to do that on the next episode of the Minish Cap, and we'll probably be heading towards the boss on the next episode, so hype, 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 hype. And I'm gonna say goodbye then. Thank you all for watching, much love.